I just woke up when the announcement tone rang out. He's early today. Good morning, everyone. He seems cheerful this morning. I'm sure everyone enjoyed yesterday's task. What? Now, after all that running around, I'm certain you'd all like some time to rest and recuperate. Another rest day. I'm giving you not one, but two rest days. That's right. Take today and tomorrow off. Have fun! I'm going back to bed. I spent most of the day just relaxing, but by mid-afternoon, I decided that it was time to give Mira a call. I pulled out my phone, one of the servants had returned it earlier, and dialed the number I knew by heart. Sure enough, it was picked up almost as soon as it began ringing. Mira, hi, it's Emma. Sorry for not call- Forget about that. Still, I'm practically bursting with curiosity here. Well, what do you want to know? Everything. The ceiling in my room is... Okay, not everything. The interesting things. You know... The food is delicious. That would be your priority. Guys, have you met any guys? Hmm, sort of. How do you sort of meet someone? Turns out the getaway is an elaborate game and no one uses their- A game? Yep, we were split into teams of four and- Any guys in your team? Three. Lucky. Any idea who they really are? None whatsoever. Well, you never did take much interest in famous people. Maybe I can help you figure it out. Maybe. Hmm. I do have to be somewhere soon, but that can wait. If you're going to have to leave, then I should probably ask about the guy I want to know about the most. Probably. Hey, do you think I look better in the red dress or the blue? Mm, blue if you're headed to a party, red if it's a date. Thanks, you're a lifesaver. So, any idea which guy you're really most interested in? Yeah, um... His name is Mr. Bandages. Mr. Who? That's his game name. Weird name. He's an arrogant model. Aren't they all? He's also really tall. So are most models. <sighs> he comes from a rich family? He wouldn't be the first model that did. I can't really help you unless you give me something more concrete. He's... competitive. Likes being in charge? Hot, but those aren't exactly rare traits. So, you have no idea? Actually, the problem is that too many people fit that description. Mm. If you said he had a tattoo, or a scar, or- He's a model, so I doubt those would be good for his career. That would depend on the type of model. A hand model wouldn't need to worry about a facial scar or back tattoo after all. Besides, those things can be photoshopped out these days. Well, even if he had those, he's always covered in bandages, so it's not like I- Is he injured? That would probably narrow. No, no, his costume is a mummy. Oh. Seems like he's really trying to keep his identity under wraps. Oh god, Mira, really? Uh, apparently Eric is really gung-ho about- Wait, you call him Eric? Is there something I should know? Everyone calls him Eric. Probably because everyone's famous. You're... not. They don't know that, so it would seem weird if I didn't. True. Look, I need to run. I know I said I could wait, but he's sort of waiting outside this entire time, so... <sighs> Go. Enjoy yourself. Oh, I will. But I think I'll be enjoying him a bit more. <sighs> Goodbye, Mira. Bye, Emma. Remember to make the most of it. <laughs> I will. I found myself awake long after I should have been for only one reason. I was hungry. I didn't even have my emergency chocolate bar anymore. I guess there's only one thing to do then. I quietly made my way out of my room and down the corridors, trying to remember the exact route the Count had taken from the team room to the kitchen. When I found the familiar double doors, I immediately pushed them open and switched on the lights. I quickly began gathering ingredients for my midnight snack. I was so absorbed in the act that I didn't even hear the double doors swing open. 
Well, that and they were remarkably quiet. Are you trying to steal my food? <laughs> I quickly spun around to see Eric standing by the entrance. No, I'm making a midnight snack. With that many ingredients, it's not a snack. It's a five-course meal. <laughs> okay, a midnight meal then. <laughs> I see. What are you doing up anyway? I couldn't sleep. <sighs> Me too. Although, I can't sleep because I'm hungry. Are you hungry? I'm probably making too much anyway, so you can eat with me. That reminds me. Edward said that you asked him to eat with you. Edward? Who's he? He was your clue the day before yesterday. Oh, him! Yes, him. Was there any particular reason? I don't like eating alone. I see. In that case, I would be honored to eat you. What? what My apologies. I meant eat with you. Oh, in that case, thank you. I think I should be thanking you. I am, after all, getting a meal out of this. He took a seat at the counter while I prepared our meal. I was just putting on the finishing touches when he spoke again. You look very much at home here. I've spent a lot of time in kitchens. I can see that. And done. I placed the plates onto the counter. I should hire you. You have too many servants already. Seriously, what do they do when you're not holding some grand event? I'm a very generous employer. As long as my orders are taken care of, they can do what they wish. That's another thing. They follow your orders to a T. I just don't know if I want to be tied down like that. Oh? Well, then it's my loss. I ignored his comment and dug in. Well, let's see how it tastes. He took a tentative bite before digging in with gusto. This is really good! You could put a lot of the world-famous restaurants I've tied at to shame. Not to mention give my own cook a run for his money. Now you're just teasing me. No, I'm serious. Aw, shucks. You didn't have to go that far, but... Thank you, Eric. No, Emma. I should be thanking you for this midnight... Uh, snack? <laughs> After a meal this good, there's no way I'll have trouble sleeping. You know my name? Of course I do. It is my duty as host to be aware of all who participate in my games. So... You know I'm nothing special, then. On the contrary, I think you're quite special. Your presence has made this game interesting. But I haven't done anything. Then perhaps this is one of your skills. My skills? You mean the cooking? He let out a low <laughs> chuckle. Yes, the cooking. We both finished our meals and I put the plates in the dishwasher. Thanks for eating with me. No, thank you. I quite enjoyed spending time with such a cute kitty. No wonder the girls go crazy for him. Good night, Emma. Good night, Eric. <laughs>